So one of the pillars of strength training is eccentric strength, which is breaks. So, um, you know, you're going to hurt yourself 10 times more likely. I'm making that number up, by the way. I don't know if it's 10 times, but experientially, it seems to be. You are 10 times more likely to hurt yourself stepping off something than stepping onto something, right? Stepping down versus stepping up. Um, because when you step up onto something, you are concentrically controlling a muscle. When you step down, you have to apply the brakes. And that's where most people falter. Much harder to walk downhill than uphill. Uphill is taxing your cardiovascular system. But if you slow down enough, you're fine. But a lot of people don't have the ability to slow themselves down when they're walking downhill. And so when an older person steps off a curb and can't fully stop themselves, and that results in a fall. So, you know, I like doing things like a broad jump. Broad jump's a fun little test set I like to do every once in a while. I always want to make sure I can broad jump six feet. That's kind of my arbitrary number that I've chosen. And the reason is on the takeoff, that's a very explosive movement. But the landing is just as important. If I can't stick that landing, it means I don't have the brakes.